Oh. Hi, I'm Carmen, and uh, pretty excited these days. Uh, Jim and I are having a show called 20, 2012, Journey 2012, sorry, and it's a little bit about our journey. And uh, as friends, friends, we've been friends for 30 years. We met at the Prairie Art Gallery many years ago, and uh, we talked about having a show, and it's pretty amazing over the years how our, both of our art has changed, and uh, I'm actually doing some landscapes now on, on wood. And uh, Jim, of course, is known for his large landscapes, but he also has some other great works that uh, are going to be in this show that uh, he's worked on over the years. And uh, that's going to be exciting for, for all of us to see uh, some of Jim's works, which he hasn't brought out of his studio. So uh, I'm excited. It's, uh, I, I hope people will come out. It's uh, May 11th is our opening. It's up for a couple months. Uh, it's a been a long process, uh, one that we've enjoyed, and uh, of course I don't do art full time like Jim does, but it's uh, it's been fun to to paint on the side of my career. I met a fellow uh, Ted Harrison, who was a, an artist from the north, that uh, when I was director curator, and uh, he painted uh, he was painting full time when I met him, but. Uh, that was, he was in his 60s, and he was a high school art teacher until I was 55, and I always thought, well, gee, I can do something else and, and still paint on the side and then eventually be full-time artist, and I think that's coming very close now. So, it's nice to have a show like this that has a catalog, uh, and working with Jim, it's been tremendous, he's an inspiration. Uh, I always say that if, you, if you're ever down, just go for a ride with Jim in the, in the landscape, and he gets very excited about how the sun hits something, or um, and uh, all the things that some some people take for granted. And I, I I see it in his art, and uh, it's uh, it's neat to be able to do a little bit of that myself. Uh, and uh, yeah, well, I hope you guys will come up and see it.